Lindsay FIFA HD and welcome back to yet another episode of my skill move tutorial series where I show you how, where and when to perform a skill move in FIFA 21. Today we are learning, and I can't believe I'm saying this, the flick up, lob, chip, shot, glitch. That is right lads, I can't believe I'm teaching this. It gives me nightmares. You know why? Because it reminds me of the FIFA 19 days and my god. That game, gave, it gave me anxiety, it really did. That was just, I don't want to talk about it, but I think FIFA 21, it's, mm, I don't want to say too much, but this skill move is a glitch, and I hope EA patch it soon enough, because it reminds me of the El Tornado shots that used to be in FIFA 19, and, oh, they were trouble, man, they were trouble. But without further ado, let's jump into the intro, and then let's get into how to perform the flick up, lob, chip shot glitch. Griezmann, three men around him, but somehow finds some space. Ronaldo, fantastic, opening the drive. Ronaldo on the ball. He's made himself this just the control. tiniest the bit control of noise. display there is absolutely ridiculous. The Elastico on the goal line. On the goal line, the finest of We talked about Aussie FIFA. He's not here to make up the numbers. Moving into how you perform the flick up chip shot glitch and that's what I'm calling it I don't think it really has a certain name although if it does please chuck it in the comment section down below what you will need to perform this is essentially the right and load stick you will then need to know how to do a chip shot now a chip shots quite simple most people would know how to perform it but if you don't all you need is the L1 button on PS4 and the shoot button okay so essentially the uh, LT button on Xbox and the shoot button and this will create or perform or make your player perform a chip shot okay in terms of doing the flick up what you will need to do is hold down or press the right analog stick and I believe the actual name for this on a PS4 at least I'm not sure about the Xbox name is R3 so essentially you need to press down on the right analog stick and what this will do is allow your player to do a flick up and he will scoop it up okay so that he can then perform this chip shot glitch if it's not working for you guys what you're gonna need to do is actually hold it down for a lot longer this can take time to register it does take time okay you don't just press it and it will perform it you do need to hold it down for quite some time for the player to do the scoop up or the flick up that this skill move performs. So essentially, if you're having trouble, don't worry, hold it down a little bit longer and he will do that. And then, after you do this, you will then need to perform the chip shot whilst pointing the left end load stick to the opposite corner. So you need to be aiming this on the far post, okay? And essentially this will lob the keeper from ridiculous angles. And I'm telling you, you can score from literally like very acute angles like 45 degrees that's how overpowered this is and it gives me nightmares let me just say that so essentially I go through it quickly once again you will need the right analog stick you will then also need to perform a chip shot hold down the right analog stick or R3 as they call it hold it down for quite some time let's say let's let's say a second okay or a second or two he will then perform it you then need to press the ship the chip the chip shot which is the L1 button and the shoot button, okay? At around two to three bars of power, okay? It will depend whereabouts you are on the pitch. If you're a little bit further back, you need to obviously do a little bit more power, but on average, two to three bars is what you need to perform in this. And you need to aim this towards the far post for this to be performed. Let's get into where you should perform this. To where you perform the flick up lob chip shot glitch essentially anywhere as I was saying in the first segment lads you can literally perform this anywhere at acute angles right in front of the goal if you want to on the edge of the 18 yard box in the box even out on the wing this works and it really surprises me that this actually oh EA you need to fix it lads fix it please don't make FIFA 21 
another FIFA 19. But <laughs> you can do it anywhere, lads. That's my point. So let's get into the net segment of when you should perform this. Moving into when, yet again, it's similar to the second segment of where. You really can do it at any time and anywhere, okay? So essentially, give yourself some space. You don't want the defender right on you, otherwise he will block it. We all know how overpowered blocks are. But if you have a little bit of space and you see the goal is open, give it a go. This will be, you will score, let's say 80 to 90% of the time. If you do, do get this down pat and if you practice enough, you will learn how much power you need to load up to perform this and it will work, as you're seeing up in front of your screen. Some of these clips, I mean, I just can't believe it works, but I'll stop complaining. I've taught you guys how to perform it. Now use it in your game and let me know how you guys go in the comment section down below. But that will see you at the end of the episode. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Smash a like, drop a follow on my Twitter, and obviously subscribe on this channel, on the YouTube channel. We're hitting up, we're getting very close to that 10K mark. So thank you ever so much for your support, and I'm out. Have a good day, guys, and peace.